Uh, hi everyone. Uh, so I'm here at the dealer, and uh, my channel is mainly about the bikes. But here and there, I throw a video about the BMWs because I had uh, quite a few, and uh, I love to do the topics on them. Now uh, this video is going to be here. Uh, what I look for a car before I take it in to a dealer for inspection. What are some red flags that I see on it uh, before I spend 200 bucks to get the car to a dealer, hook it up on a, you know, uh, so on. So the first thing that I want to do over here, uh, okay, while I'm at it, uh, hopefully, by the way, I apologize, the road is right there, so it's a little bit noisy. But the first thing that I see over here, just to kind of see if the owner took care of the car, uh, the clear coat. Now, I'm not sure if you're going to be able to see here, but this vehicle here, zoom in, uh, probably on this side, if you look at the, the, the darker section here, it has a, quite a few swirl marks. Uh, if I go if I go over here, if I go on top of the here, I, I don't have uh, swirl marks on my beamer here. This is where they usually, you don't get them here. They're usually over here, because this is where the car gets dirty. But I see that the clear coat is even beaten up pretty here. Uh, the, 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 the paint is definitely going to need about a thousand bucks, trust me, to get this going. Hopefully you can see the holograms over here on, a, on the thing. Uh, so, that's, so that's the first uh, negative that I see here. Uh, if I go in the interior over here, uh, the steering wheel is pretty greasy along with the seats. So that would confirm that the detailing was never done on this vehicle here. Okay, so that's that's for the interior and exterior. Now, what I usually tend to do over here, I would check the tires. I would check the tires and the brakes. Uh, uh, right now, it's the summer season. I see the winter tires. It's a huge red flag. Now, the, the rotors seem to be pretty, pretty old. Uh, there's something going on there. I think there was a lip. And I think they shaved up the, the ridge on the on the discs so uh, a red flag with the uh, good news that it has a really nice winter tires but the, the red flag is we are in the summertime we're in the summer season so that's that's the that's an issue there so I want to see I want to see how the summers look like uh, again the the brakes the brakes are in bad condition uh, and how much uh, yeah and I see a little bit of just a little bit of uh, on the meat on the pads so if you over to see just a tiny bit of there so so far over here i don't know the mileage but uh we got the bad brake job we got the uh questionable tires why are the winters on and uh, so so right off the bat 1000 for the front brakes 1000 for the rear 1000 for the uh detailing and to get the this, this is definitely I would I would fail this vehicle before you go before you go uh, waste the uh, three thousand right there. Now I'm gonna have a look over here. This Audi similar kind of paint job, but what I would do uh, like this is a newer Beamer, definitely with a decent paint job. I would look into something like this. But this is this would be my three giveaways. Oh, by the way, the very last one, the why I'm saying this, the very last one, you want to see if uh, what's underneath, if there's a puddle. These cars have a, they, they develop the leaks. They're pretty pricey to fix. So if the person couldn't afford to do the detailing, couldn't afford to do the, the pads, chances are he doesn't have money to do, to fix the, uh, uh, the leaks. Uh, I, I quite a few times this was driven by some punk and now when the when the car has repairs you know now this is the time when, when they want to unload trade it in then get rid of the vehicle and they're looking for some you know you could be the one taking over which is not a good idea hopefully you found this video useful like subscribe and I'll be doing more videos about the beamers in the future take care bye bye